your local weather authority forecast. Well, friends, happy Saturday. Now, let's talk about Saturday. Let's talk about today. Today was a hot day in the base. When I say hot, I'm saying with a capital H. Taking a look at our Midland Sky Cam, it does show some really clear conditions going on. A clear sky, a clear night sky. We did have a clear day sky. So, not bad at all. Some driving conditions we too clear. We do see a couple cars, you know, driving nice and slow, taking it easy, a way with windows down, a way to cool on off because today was some hot temperatures. Today we managed to get into our triple digits at 103 degrees. Usually this time in May, we're definitely used to 86 degree temperatures, but the one thing that we can say for today is that we actually tied and came in even with our record back in 2009. Now, not also that, but our lows did come in warm as well. 63 degrees for our lows. Usually around this time, we're definitely used to 54, 59 degree temperatures. So definitely not bad at all. Now taking a look at the entire Permian Basin, seeing everyone's temperatures, everyone pretty much in the triple digits. In Middle Odessa area, 103 degrees. In Big Spring, 104 degrees. Middle Odessa tying with Slander at 103 degrees. In Seminole, 101 degrees. And in Dryden, sitting at the highest for today, 107 degrees. So definitely not too bad whatsoever. In this moment, as the sun has gone down, so are temperatures, so we'll make it all the way to a cool 66 degrees. The one thing about humidity is that it is sitting pretty low, sitting at 32, 32%. Our dew point sitting at 21, and our winds are front and center, traveling west-southwest at 10 miles per hour. Now, taking a look at what we can see for tomorrow morning, now we are going to have a warm start. We'll be sitting in our 70s, a warm start, not only that, but our winds will be front and center, traveling west at 15 to 20 miles per hour. Here's what we can take a look for the that day planner. Eventually, it will show that I'll show the day planner, but what we do have in this moment, continuing on, is that fire weather warning lasting until tomorrow, 9 p.m. at Central Time. Now, going into that day planner, we're going to have a warm start sitting at 68, which is nearing the 70s. Then by noon, that's when temperatures do increase really fast to 93 degrees. We will be heating up even hotter. That's why it's time we get into 5 p.m., a hot afternoon, all caps and hot, sitting at 101 degrees. So definitely not bad whatsoever. A couple fire weather tips for you guys. Guys, avoid outdoor burning or a spark. Even the smallest spark can cause the largest of wildfires because we're going to be so hot tomorrow. Also, one major thing, drink plenty of water. Not only that, but wear light-colored clothing and sunscreen to combat that heat that we will be seeing. Taking a look at what we do have for Mother's Day tomorrow, the only thing that's going to be high in our algae report is our trees, but our reeds, grass, dust, and mold sitting at a low level. Definitely not too bad whatsoever. And there we go, Mother's Day. That Sunday, we will be sitting at at a sunny Sunday, a very hot Sunday, a very breezy Sunday, Rob, at 101 degrees. We'll have a little bit of some rain showers Tuesday and Thursday, but we're we'll going to continue on with that triple-digit heat until Monday. Well, it sounds like the time of the year to stay inside the living room where it's nice and cool or maybe yes. go off to the movies, but I'm not going to be outside too much. You and me both. <laughs> Thanks a lot, Bridget.